Pat also with you as we continue from inside one memorial at the Sobrato Center. The USF Dons go to 9-0 with a convincing win here tonight, 83-62 over the UNLV run the Rebels. We're joined here courtside now by USF's fine senior point guard, Jamari Bouye. JB, you were feeling it uh, really throughout the ball game, that step back threes. It didn't matter if you were, you know, two feet behind the line or six feet behind the line. What was it tonight that you had that special feeling going? Uh, coming in today, I just, uh, my teammates believed in me. Uh, I was kind of lacking confidence, honestly, but uh, they kind of woke me up and Khalil kind of told me to just relax and uh, just be myself. And I came out and hit like the first two and then I hit the third one. And then after that, I just kind of got a rhythm. I just kept firing away and they kept going in. They just kept going in and hitting the bottom part of the net. <laughs> I got to ask you about your teammate down low because this team, we know the last couple, three years, has had a lot of talent in the backcourt. Yourself, Khalil Shabazz, you bring in Stefanini, Rich Wayne, but what Yawin Misalski brings inside, it brings a different element for this team. For sure. He had 23 points, 13 rebounds in the championship game in Vegas at the Las Vegas Invitational, and he just picked right up where he left off in that tournament here tonight. He had 18 points and 16 rebounds. He's a monster. He makes you guys a different team. Uh, he completes our team. I, like, like you said, uh, our last couple of years we were kind of lacking in big men, and S Squirrel came in and just from the get-go just kind of dominated his role. And uh, he, he loves his role. He, uh, he's a great defender. He's a great rebounder, and he can score the basketball, as we can see now. And uh, I think at San Diego he was a great player, and he didn't really get a spotlight, and now he's getting it. You said squirrel. I know that. That's, where's <laughs> yeah. that come from? That nickname. Uh, he honestly, I don't know. He came in here and I was like, "Yo, what's, the island's kind of long, but also he's kind of hard." You know, he said, "What should I call you?" He says, "Call me squirrel." That's what people call me. I was like, "Squirrel, it is." All right, squirrel, it is. I, I love it. And the thing I like about him, he has a ton of personality. Doesn't absolutely. He? And that kind of rubs off on the for team. For sure, a bit. he's a he's a fun, outgoing guy. You know, he's a great leader for sure. Uh, he keeps guys inspired. You know, when guys are down or guys are tired, he kind of yells at you and he keeps you accountable. But it's also in a good way, and it kind of inspires us to be better as a team. You know, as you look at this team now, 9-0, you got Fresno State coming up on Wednesday. I'll ask you about them in a minute. But this team, and I know in talking to yourself, Meeks, other guys that I've seen here, you know, I, I do the volleyball games, mm -hmm. and I see a lot of the, the basketball players come in as a group Absolutely. to support women's women's volleyball. It just shows kind of the, the, you know, the teamwork, how this team feels about each other, doesn't it? I think we have a, a great group. You know, we have a lot of camaraderie and stuff. So uh, I think we kind of stay connected, whether it's off the court or on the court. Like I said, like uh, a couple weeks back, I said uh, the bond is just uh, unbreakable. You know, we have guys that just want to win. When you guys, we have guys that want to win, you come together and you do stuff together, and it just helps your team on the court as well as off the court. JB, as we let you go, final thought. Tell us about the goal down the line for this USF team. I, I hear the word March come up a lot when I talk to your guys. You 100%. guys want to be playing basketball in March. Uh, I want to be honest with you. I came back for mainly one reason, but two reasons. I, I, uh, I had to be loyal to the coaches that got me here and the school that got me here, but the second thing was go to the tournament, you know, so I'm doing everything I possibly can. I know my guys doing everything we can to get to that tournament, and it's one game at a time, so we're just going to keep working and win one game at a time. One game at a time. Next up, you have Fresno State. They got the big guy Robinson yes, inside, so you guys better be ready on Wednesday. We'll be ready. We'll, we'll make sure we work hard this week and this, over this weekend, and uh, we'll be ready. JB, savor the moment. Uh, it's always fun after a win. We'll For see sure. you out here on I'll Wednesday. definitely enjoy it. Thank you. All right, Jamari Bouye, and boy, is he had a